Thank you for Patreon now for donating to the Patreon. Hey guys, this video is so back in another um, Pokemon so Sword and Shooter video. If you enjoyed, don't like, subscribe, and don't the Patreon. We'll start it, shall we? Finally, after all that time, I have my ideal outfit, which I will show off once we get into the wild area. It took all the way to fighting Kabu because I really like his fire type outfit, and I was able to get the black clothes, and I was able to get the right cap. I finally got it all, so now we are looking at the brand new and improved Vanity Ezel in the wild area, and I'm gonna take off my bike right now. See, look at me. I'm so incredible. Got the sheet black. Uh, it messes with my style. Um, normal flying type. You know, I feel like fighting it. No, I didn't mean to do that. No, I didn't want to do that. Uh, just ready for battle. Yeah, so, you know, it's been a while since we took on a, um, a wild area match. And it. No, 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 actually, I thought the camera paused for a second. Ah, uh, yes, my outfit is perfect for this. Oh, you! Oh, Tranquil. I haven't seen you in ages. Well. Hmm. It's also really calm. I don't know why. So let's get that. Let's get that Dynamax ready. Okay. Let's do this. Go, Max Flare. Dynamax activate. Ah, uh, but yes. Yeah, I, I have been waiting the whole time for this. Like, this is honestly one of my favorite <laughs> outfits that I've ever made in a Pokemon game before. And I really wish I could keep it whenever we would do challenges, especially because the undershirt that I have for this is um, Kabu's uh, gym challenge uniform. But unfortunately, I can't, which sucks. But go, Max, for oh, yes, you, you see my hand do that pose. Oh, this is beautiful. This is going to be so epic. Anyways, now our fire type moves are stronger, but water type moves are weaker, which I feel kind of bad for because now I realize that we have a... Um, What's it called on our team? A quillfish, a water type, but hey, on the bright side, we have, okay, well one, that was the one that was killed. Oh, barely not killed, but it's the, <laughs> it's the only water type, and we have another fire type to bounce it out, so it's not like we're in the worst situation. But also it's speed rolls, which isn't good. Oh, okay, well waterfall's not gonna do anything. Snorlax maybe kills, wow, you have giga impact. Okay then, well, let's end up with another max flare, shall we? The lag is real. Easy. Actually, way too easy. You know, I'll try to catch it. Uh, what Pokeballs do I have? I, I have a Great Ball, right? Great Ball, go! I need to order my Pokeballs again. Go! You got to max! Great Ball! Start of a Burning Legend! Tail has... I mean, sorry, not Tail. Uh, Hop has the tail of his legend. Fear the blazing trail of mine! That is... I really wish I could have a camera now, because now every time I do something, I'm going to try to make it epic, because I have my own actual character now. Unfortunately, I will never be able to take on gym leaders with this outfit, because we always only take on gym leaders in the challenge areas, which means I can't use this outfit, which is useless, but it's it's fine. That's the one time, like, I hate a Pokemon style design. Like, why did they lock you into the gym outfit thing? Why couldn't they have just, or just at least let you use other gym outfits, not just the one? But it, it's fine the way it is, I guess. But, hey, let's go. I could catch more Pokemon, I really could, but I don't feel like it, and I'm also just gonna use this to kind of speed it up, because we got a long way to go, I tell you. Especially because I might encounter certain things, and I don't want to take chances. So, let's just kind of take a nice stroll through. Oh, uh, this is gonna be a nice place. You know, I kind of want to walk. Oh, what do you do? You'll be amazed at catching that bridge. What's so amazing, the Pokemon that live on the other side, they're so strong. You probably won't be able to catch them unless you have several gym badges, though. Okay, he wouldn't say that unless, like, I actually wasn't prepared, but there's Hammerlock all the way over there. Hi, Snorlax! I almost ran right into you! I'm gonna get more berries, because I'm kind of running low on my supplies. Uh, only a Lepa berry? I'm gonna take it twice more. Okay, three berries. Let me check it. Damn it. Yeah, the second I knew the berries didn't drop. Oh, this thing! Well, I was trying to see it before. Greed Ant. That's the evolved form of the China Monk. Not China Monk. That is from a different game. How do I remember that? I haven't seen that game so long. But a certain, the, the normal type Pokemon of this game, basically. The one that we saw earlier. Or at least I know we saw it earlier. I think we saw it earlier. Point is, I need to kill this thing. Because, I mean, we're going to lose our berries. God damn you. If I hit it with Flame Charge, how much damage would I deal with? Because I don't want to just sit here for a while and then have this thing take up most of my thing. Also, it's going to hail in the wild area now, apparently. Because the wild area just likes to change its uh, stats randomly, which is really nice. It gives it a nice little uh, bonus to it. Flame charge. 
Oh, okay, flame charge is decent now, actually. We got some speed ups. Fast asleep. See, I swear, if it wakes up and then it just goes right back to sleep, I'm just gonna give up on this battle. I actually might try to catch it, because normally I don't catch Pokemons of all forms, but this time I might just make an exception just to have it on the team, because I know I'm not gonna evolve it. Still fast asleep, which means it's probably gonna wake up next turn. I'm gonna try to hit it with a heat tackle or flame charge. Okay, now I can't distinguish the two between each other. And if it dies, then it dies. If it wakes up and rests, then I will just run away, because I'm not doing this again. Cool, we got some uh, nice speed ups. Woke up, shout, swallow. You know, it is awake now and I could, mm. We'll try it, screw it. I normally wouldn't do this, but I just wanna see if I can catch it. Cause I've never actually read its bad description. Mainly because while I have caught it before, I've, or at least caught its first form, I've never actually evolved it. Cause I played this game once before I started this let's play. So yeah, it wasn't really a smart idea. Chewie got a level up who did absolutely nothing in the gym out. Sorry Chewie, I know you had a big role, but I just kind of sideswiped you. Greed ant, the greedy Pokemon, it stashes berries in its tail. So many berries that can fall out constantly. But this Pokemon is a bit slow-witted and it does not notice the loss. Well, if it didn't notice the loss, then why did it bother me and make me lose all my berries? Uh, well, it, oh, it only took a Lepa? Really? No, it took a lot of things. Because <laughs> I know we had four and I only got two. Well... Cool, we got that thing at least. So now time to make our way through. Here we got some vanillites. Ooh, what's that? Okay, those are combis. Ah! <laughs> help, help. Oh, seasonal, seasonal. Oh, okay. Actually, I could try catching a seasonal. Oh my god, they're chasing me. Oh shit, you, you. Okay, you are really close to me. Yeah, so I think that thing's just never gonna bother me again. Um, makes it through grass trying to knock it. Ooh, you're interesting. Oh, you're a cool fish. Never mind. I like how he should be. Ah! I should have been paying attention. But I like how very strong looking. Oh, that helps. Um, what? How strong looking are we talking? Nope, 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 nope. A thousand times. No! I want to get away from this thing because now I know it has counter. Okay, there we go. I could have tried finding it and I would get a fuck ton of experience off that, but I don't want to. Like, because I'm already over leveled. I already have a bunch of. Pokemon actually evolved. Plus, like, I'll explore you. You, son of a bitch. If I, what, what would happen if I do this? Oh, shit. How fast are you? How fast are you? It's actually not that fast. Ah, okay, it's barreling towards me. Everyone help. Ah, okay, okay. Oh, you, 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 you. I was about to go away, and then I saw it. I told you earlier I wanted this Pokemon, and I won't rest until I get it. Q, Q fan. I don't know what type you are, but you are coming on this team, buddy. Go, Flame Charge. No! I did not know you were Steel- I know it's Evolution is Steel type. I am so glad that did not kill it. Whew, okay. Thankfully, I didn't do something stupid, and I was able to catch it. That's good. That was so close. Q fan. Hey, it's pure steel. Copper Dam Pokemon. Uh, it digs up the ground with its trunk. It's also very strong, being able to carry loads of five tons without any problem. Um. Yes, you're a good boy. Good, because I have the perfect nickname. But you know I don't nickname Pokemon unless they're going on my team. We have two flying types. And one of them proved absolutely useless during the last gym challenge, and the other one was actually useful. And the other one that I, the one that was useless is also part steel type when it evolves. And you can't tell where I'm going with this, Raven. Listen, you've been a part of our team, but let's be fair, I never liked you from the beginning. Manny joins the party, and I love elephants. Like I was throwing the thing on our team regardless, just because I love elephants. Already it was coming on, and we got another Noibat. I'm not gonna catch it though. I, you can go the fuck away and never come near me again, please. Oh, that... Nope, not even. Normally if you see a building on your own, do not walk towards it, it's probably cursed. Oh my god, there's another one. I thought it was rare as hell from what my friend told me, but I found two of them almost immediately. I mean, granted, I, I didn't see it in my last plus play, but I still found it. Okay. Cool, bag of stardust and more stardust. Uh, let's get some things. I would take a Sneasel if I actually saw another Sneasel, just because I want an Ice type, but I probably wouldn't use it, though, just because, um... It's not a, uh, Galarian form. Wow. 
I found two ice types and one of them was a Sneasel. You know, maybe if I just want things, I should just say them, because apparently I get what I say. And I like how Leon's on the background of my shirt. That's the one thing I don't like about my shirt. But... Don't die to this. Don't die to this, please. Wow. I, I can't tell if it's luck now, or if it's just, like... It's gonna die, isn't it? What is with all these miracles? I, survives by one health, doesn't kill Pokemon I want to catch? I'm sorry, what universe did I enter in that I have godlike luck? Whatever universe it is, can I stay in here? What devil did I make a deal with? I'm not even, like, last time it was a bit, this time it's not. I'm actually questioning a lot of things now. But, cool, knowing about it leveled up, I mean, Rev, Re Re Revan leveled up. Cup chill, chill Pokemon. Cool, 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 we can chill. I know you don't have a glare in form, I'm not gonna use you, I'm sorry buddy. I really wanna use you though. Uh, back, 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 just in case the, uh, Sneasel comes and I need to heal. Actually, that's what I should've spent my money on. I should've bought fucking items to use, cause I'm running low on health, but I didn't, because I'm not exactly known for my smarts. Let's take on the Sneasel, just to try to catch it. If I can catch a Sneasel, I'll catch a Sneasel. If I can't, then I won't, but it's how it will go. I kind of want to hit it with Flame Charge, because I think it can survive a Flame Charge, but I don't want to take that chance. Oh, it's actually higher level than me. I probably could go with that Flame Charge. Fury Swipes. That's not that strong. And I say that, and it does 10 damage per hit. Or 7 damage per hit. One of the two. It was like 7 and 8. Damn, I really could have used that Flame Charge, couldn't I? And he would have been fine. If I do Ember again... Icy Wind. Okay, that's not super effective. Frankly, it's very not effective. So as long as it doesn't freeze me, I'm fine, right? Okay, well, it doesn't freeze, thankfully, and it only speed lowers. Now, that's fine with me, because it's already faster. And, okay, I don't kill it. Do I not burn it? Good. I I'm actively trying to not kill these things. Go Great Ball. For once, I'm trying to catch Pokemon. Ah, uh, you can see the joy in my character's eye. That's why, uh, okay, well, apparently he doesn't want to be caught. Can I not catch Pokemon of a certain level? I swear I could catch a Pokemon of a certain- Maybe I need an Ultra Ball for him, but I don't have a fucking Ultra Ball. Um, well, this is my best bet then. Premier Ball. Of all times for me to use a Critical Capture, now is one of them, but okay. Sorry, Axel, I tried. Apparently the game doesn't want to get caught. So, we're gonna do this. Run away. Okay, well, that failed. Um... Sure, Goose might handle it, because you have a long way to evolve. Because everyone else on my team... Well, Bolton has evolved, and that's his final form. He's staying that way forever. I forgot you're a dark type. Um, let's see. Uh, Choodle is in his final form already. Uh, Lunoon still has one more to go, but he doesn't get it to, like, level 48 or 50. Um, obviously, our starter has a third form that's coming up soon. Uh, Copper Roger Boy... I mean, not Copper Roger. Copper Roger is the evolved form. Manny has one evolution. I don't know when he gets it, but thankfully he's near it, I think. I don't know actually when he gets his level up, so I'm assuming it's near. I just don't know how close. And Revan, we all know he doesn't evolve to level 48, so we've got a long ways to go before our team is fully evolved. But, you know, having two members fully evolved is a good start. So let's get some items, and then we're going to continue our way through the uh, wild area towards Hammerlock. Oh, let's go. Getting two items. Bag of Stardust. Another bag of Stardust. And oh, okay. I did not see that coming, and I'm really glad I was able to avoid it. I'm just gonna not even deal with those two. I hate both of those Pokemon, so that's an excuse for me not to do it. Ah, get away from me. I, every time those pop up, I get scared because I'm worried that I'm gonna die. You know what? Screw it. I'll fight this one. Just to level up, just to level up my starter more, I will fight this. Hello, Pumpkaboo. I'm this Pumpkaboo. If you can take an attack but still go down to either low, yellow, or red, I will willingly catch you, but that involves you surviving. Go Flame Charge. Wow. I did not think it would survive that. Well, it did. Now I kind of have to honor that promise. Trick or treat. So, apparently Axe is now a Ghost type. Why? Wait, is Ghost super effective against Ghost? I always forget that. I know it was at some point, or at least I think it was at some point. Is it super effective against it now? Because if it is, I'm very worried about that, but... Cool, Axe is level 30. He wants to headbutt. Yes, please. Never mind. Yeah. As much as I would like that... Actually, no, Axe is typically pretty faster than other Pokemon. And when he evolves, he will get a lot faster. So, well, Cook Attack will probably win me games at some point. Headbutt's the way to go. Now we go on. 
just get this. And, okay, cool. We can probably just book it towards Hammerlock, because Hammerlock's right there. You son of a bitch. And I see a pseudo widow, and I saw the Machamp again. I could catch a Machamp. I could. That's the evolved form of Corvus Squire. I like its evolved form, but it served no purpose to me in the final stages of the game, so I kind of just got rid of it. So, yeah, I'm, I'm not... Sorry, Corvus Squire. Nothing against you. Actually, I could use one of you two, because one of you two gives me things. You're the one that gives me cook. Right, yeah. Um... Because I have so much money to spend. There are ways not to use that money, especially because now that I have my outfit, I don't need this money anymore. Like, that's genuinely why I was saving up so much, but uh, once I got it, kind of don't need this. Actually, no, there is still one more part of my outfit I do actually need, but I don't know when I can get it. It might be in Hammerlock, but I'm not exactly sure. Let's go ahead and buy two of everything. Actually, that's something we haven't done, and it's been so long, and I kind of skipped a lot in this wild area, so... Okay, no, I'm not doing this. Uh, am I gonna have to do another Wild Air Exploration episode? Mate. I was gonna end the episode, but I wanna do a small de- Yeah, do a small detour. How close is that? Kind of far. Mm. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna quickly do one Pokemon camp, just because I really wanna play with my Pokemon again, and I just wanna, you know, Get some experience, add some more friendship, because one, I think my Pokemon do deserve it, like, genuine, well, one, just to, um, call over our friends once more, but also, oh, hey, Botan, a uh, toy. Uh, Axel, get the toy! But also because, like, you know, after all these matches we've, we've been doing, um, okay, thank you. After all these matches we've been doing, it's been, uh, where am I trying to go with this? They, they have all taken some really big hits for us, so I'm kind of trying to appreciate that back by doing that. Is that, is that going to run towards it? Shit, he is. Where'd he go? Okay, he's going that way. And he's going on his way. Oh, he grabbed it. Nice job, Axel. I wish Kaparajo would pay attention, but I think, um, Noibash is very interested. So we're going to do one last thing. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Who wants to come over here? Who wants to come over here? Apparently Axel doesn't want to pay attention, and neither does anyone else. Cool, so we're just gonna go cooking then, and use our new ingredients, because why not? Uh, let us use pack of potatoes. Yeah, pack of potatoes. That should be good. And berry time. We will use two orins. Uh We'll use three of these. I am not reading any of them at all. Frankly, I'm kind of just throwing them in as we go. Uh, one of this. One of this. And screw it, let's throw in another one of this. And let us do this. Like the noise Nobat's making? Go, 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 go. Fan flame, fan flame. Hyper speed, hyper speed, hyper speed. Go, 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 go. Yes, 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 yes. Fire. Burn brightly. Oh, he's brought over. Must be really good then. I should probably calm down a bit. But I don't want to burn it, is the thing. That's actually going out pretty well. I'm surprised by that. I normally would have burned it by now. And okay. Easy movement of speed. Yeet. Once I learned I could just do this, this will become a lot easier, but at the same time a lot harder to keep stuff in, but I stopped caring about it a long time ago. I don't know why, the cooking feels longer now. Maybe I'm just crazy, or maybe it's because I'm cooking alone. Yeet. There we go. And finally, put your heart into it. I don't know what the green line is supposed to do to that, so I'm going to do there. Explosive curry. Done. I like how Noibat came over here. Oh, everyone wants to eat it. I like how Linen's just being about us. Spicy plenty of potato curry. Well, let's see how it tastes. Okay, oh, yeah, pretty good, pretty good. I don't think that's better than what we had before. Or it might be, who knows. Yeah, it's still a military class, but hey, you know, we got uh, people friendly towards us. We got some more experience. I'm fine with that. Ah, uh, not as much as I wanted to, though. And that's what's going to be the end of this episode, because, <laughs> to be fair with you, I'm not exactly sure how long this episode's been going, because I recorded this on two separate days. So, yeah. And then I, or I could just do that on accident. Cool. Ah, a gym challenger. Allow me to check your gym badges. The grass badge, the water badge, and the fire badge. It's confirmed that you've defeated three Motostroke gym leaders, and the leader of Motostroke. Okay, well, that was wrong order, but still. I wish you the best of luck in your future battles. Oh, it's you. I doubt Hop will be coming. It's only natural. 
And so after such a humiliating defeat, there's no way he could look at the champion in the eye. I'm sure he'll withdraw from the challenge. What did you do to my hop, damn it? Here, just look at the gym badges I've already won. Nah, get your ass back here. We fight it now. Thank you, Challenger Beat. I can confirm the required badges. Anyway, I have a meeting with the chairman, so I must excuse myself. You freaking asshole! <sighs> I hate this man. I want to strangle him. Well, yeah, I guess I will end this episode here. We have done enough exploring of the wild area. I am just going to do one more thing just to see what this Pokemon is. And I might just go silent for it because, to be fair with you, I'm kind of done with recording this. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, donate to the Patreon, join the Discord, follow the Twitch, and I'll see you all in the next one. Don't forget to check us out while I time that perfectly. Let's just see what's in here. Yeah, okay, don't forget to check us out. I'm <laughs> sorry.